I am Dr. Girija, Associate Professor, Hindustan College of Engineering and Technology, Coimbatore. In this video, we are going to see two dimensional random variables. Before that, we have to see some of the definition of sample space and random experiment. Sample space means when we are tossing a coin we have results that is either head or tail the head and the tail together called the sample space the experiment which we are tossing a coin the results more than one results we can get it and also the what results we can get is not known is called random experiment now we have to go and see the definition of two dimensional random variables let us be a sample space associated with the random experiment e let x and y be two diamond two random variables defined on s then their pair x comma y is called a two dimensional random variable the variable x comma y at a point is given by ordered pair of real numbers x of s y of s equal to x comma y where x of s equal to x y of s equal to y there are two types of random variables we are going to see here that is first one is discrete random variable then second one is continuous random variable now we have to discuss about discrete random variable discrete means disjoint that is discrete random variables have a countable number of outcomes two dimensional ra discrete random variables means the possible value of x comma y are finite or countably infinite then x comma y is called a two dimensional discrete random variable when x comma y is a two dimensional discrete random variable the possible value of x comma y may be represented as x i comma y j where i varies from 1 to n and j varies from 1 to m the examples of two dimensional discrete random variables are dead and alive tossing a dice etc now we have to see the definition of continuous random variable continuous means infinite continuum of possible values now we have to see the definition if x comma y can take all the values in region r an x y plane then x comma y is called a two dimensional continuous random variable examples of two dimensional continuous random variables is blood pressure speed of a car real numbers from 1 to 6 now we have to see how to frame a sample space consider an x Experiment, experiment of tossing a coin twice the sample space is x s equal to head 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 tail tail head and tail tail let x denote the number of heads obtained in the first task and y denote the number of heads in the second task then the sample space is s head 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 tail tail head tail tail now x toss we are going to write means that is first first getting head x of s equal to 1 1 0 0 then y of s is second getting head that is 1 0 1 0 x comma y is a two dimensional random variable or bivariate random variable the range space of x comma y is 1 comma 1 1 comma 1 that is 1 comma 1 
1 comma 0, 0 comma 1, 0, 0, which is a finite and and so x comma y is two dimensional discrete random variable. In discrete random variable, we have five important terms that is joint probability function or joint probability mass function. Second one is joint probability distribution function. Then marginal probability function of x, marginal probability function of y, conditional, finally conditional probability function. Now what is, now we have to see what is joint probability distribution. The probabilities of two events a equal to x and b equal to y have defined as a function of x and y respectively called probability distribution function. That is fx of x equal to p of x is less than or equal to x. Similarly, we can, we can define as fy of y equal to probability of y is less than or equal to y. The joint probability distribution of two random variables x and y b f x f of x comma y equal to probability of x is less than or equal to x y is less than or equal to y that is x and y we have to write together now in this video we we have seen some of the properties of discrete random variables then continuous Con continuous random variables and join probability distribution. This video will give some of the ideas about two dimensional random variable of x and y. Thank you.